I'm joined now by Gav Hurran. Um So it's a, it's a bit while after the game now. Is it all sunk in? Uh, yeah, it has. And uh, I'm actually... I couldn't have asked for any more after this group of players. Um, all year, they've, they've represented myself and themselves, the team and the club, um, to what we want. And it, 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 there's always going to be ups and downs, Stu. And uh, we've finished on a high. We've won the game. We've come to a place where not many teams pick points up anyway. And to play the way we have and create the goals we, we have and all the fans it was just it's, it's, it's a really really nice feeling in the sense of yes there's a little there's a lot of disappointment we've not made the playoffs through goal difference but um, to see what this club is doing and where it's going it's it's an amazing feeling in the sense of uh, yeah I'm, I'm really I'm, I'm really happy I'm disappointed like you are but to finish the way we have there it's a uh, it's a really nice feeling. Yeah, absolutely. From last season to this, I mean, I mean, how many places is that that you've improved on on last season? So, it's the echo of a lot of positives, but so many so far, wasn't it? That uh, you know, sort of like tinges it at the end, even though it, you know it, we played absolutely brilliant. Today. Of course, of course, and in, in it's it you, you'll you'll look through everything and where we're going to improve, and that's what we do. It's it's like we win a game of football, we then go okay, where did where can we prove on that performance and off the field from where this club uh, since Jed has took over and I know it was three years prior to myself coming in but how he's built this with everybody else volunteers board of directors and the, the fan base it's just an amazing football club uh, the infrastructure's there I was saying last year the only thing that was probably holding the football club up was the, the first team in the sense of the performances and the way we played at times but it's a, it's a project isn't it and this year we, we, we've shown that um, if we, we play to our, our strengths and we recruit the way we have um, and play with freedom and enjoyment it, it, will, it will show on that pitch and I think to this season we've done that in abundance I think some of the goals we've scored the wins we've 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 took, and um, just the interaction with the whole town. I think the whole thing with the fans, and like I said on Thursday to you, the the scholars, the the academy, the girls teams, the everything. I, I mean, I'm probably forgetting and missing certain things out, but I talk the way I do, Stu, because I mean it comes from the heart, and I, I thank Jed for giving me this opportunity to manage a football club. But also, I thank the players and I thank the fans because it, it, it makes it all worthwhile. And it's, um, I'm going to enjoy our win. Yep. I will reflect over the summer. And when I sit with Jen next week and we, we see where we're going to go, um, I just believe we have to we have to improve on this. And it, and it shows the mark how, how much we the town's taken to the football team. There was 50-odd people on a coach today and that's been unheard of, isn't it? Well, that's just one coach. There was two coaches that came. There's fans that have travelled in their own cars. Um, the disappointment, and, and, and it, it's the same with Jed as the chairman and, and my management team. It's when we don't perform, you, you feel because we're all football people and we're football fans. When you pay your money on the gates and to come and watch and support your team through thick and thin, you'll always follow your football team. But when the, you don't put that performance in, it's, you, you feel like frustrated and let down and, you've, and but today and at a massive parts of this season I know these fans have gone away happy win lose or draw yep. they've gone away happy and their support today to top off this season um, is outstanding I say it every week I thank them but to come down with two coach loads and everybody else the numbers they came orange and blue everywhere I think I've seen William Shakespeare a few times it was amazing and uh, I'm just glad speaking to a lot of them in the bar after that they're, they're going to come back <laughs> and want us to keep supporting next season and um, yeah I'm, I'm happy for them and I'm happy for the football club So you've got to start planning for next year now? Yep and the plan it always starts and we've got to sit down next week we're going to quickly map out and draw where we want to go and the, again I always say profile the player we've got an amazing squad here already we will need to add because we always want to improve and um on and off the field so look we'll see what happens I'm really happy with how the season's gone and uh, I wish everybody a lovely summer 
I want all the boys to relax and enjoy the summer with their families. I want all the fans to do the same. And then me and Jed and the, my management team and the, the club will get back on it and hopefully come pr- first game of pre-season we'll have it all boxed off. Brilliant. Well done, Thank Gaz. you so thank much, you. Stu. And by the way, thank you, Stu. Home and away. <laughs> Thursday evenings. So, no, thank you again, Stu. All right.